and it is purple ladies and gentlemen it's purple give me anything oh my god oh my god we got it what's going on ladies and gentlemen welcome to the eighth episode of the tumikin's shadow rebuild where we are rebuilding our bank after buying a tumikin's shadow in the last episode we got this beautiful void waker blade one of the best special attacks in the game and we made a fair chunk of change we're sitting on a 216 million gp cash stack so apart from our Tumican Shadow, the bank is currently worth 814 million GP, which is good enough for baseline gear in just about every combat style. But if we want to be a real old school RuneScape Chad, then we need potentially the biggest upgrade an account can possibly get, the Twisted Bow. Now the Twisted Bow is currently sitting at a cool 1.395 billion GP, which means I need to make about just under 600 million GP. We're going to try to do that in this episode. How are we going to do that? To start, oh, I'm sad to be saying this, but we are going to be taking an adventure back to the Tombs of a Masket. But I'm currently sitting on 150 expert mode KC. I think I'm going to do 50 KC to get that to 200. I'm going to copy Tasty, and there was another YouTuber, insert his name now to give him credit, Jiul, doing really chill 400. If you remember correctly, I was doing 435s, and I started to get a little burnt. You know, it's not that they were super hard. I was able to clear them, but I really had to sweat my balls off to do it, because um, I'm not like the biggest gamer in the world. I'm an okay gamer. But... So I think I'm going to go with like a chill 400 setup. I'm going to learn how to skull skip on Warden P3, and I should be getting about a 10%, a 1 in 10. We'll do 50 raids in theory, since it's a 1 in 10. We should get 5 drops in that time. There is the potential for our RNG to catch up, and we hit like, we go crazily. We get like a Missouri body, like a couple Missouri pieces, maybe one or two fangs. And that would put us a good portion of the way toward that 600 mil. Thank you guys very much for tuning in. If you enjoy the content, please feel free to drop a like or a subscription to the channel. I think like 10% of my viewers are subscribed to my channel. 10%. So if you want to increase that number, make numbers go up. That's why we play this game, for the numbers to go up. Make my numbers go up. Drop a sub to the channel. Appreciate it. Thank you guys so much. Much love. Grab a drink. Chill out. Let's hang out. There we go. Everything acquired. Let's attach our jaw. Let's uh, attach our fang. Easy game. Okay, this was kind of the setup that I was running before. Now, you may look at this and say, oh, dear, you have no range weapon, you absolute fool. And I would say, I have 137 million GP sitting in my inventory. This time, because we made an absolute killing, just an obscene amount of money, uh, we're going to be buying the crystal body and the crystal legs, and the bofa is going to be a great combo. I'm just sitting here waiting for my stuff to buy. I don't mean the noob shame. Okay, everybody was a noob at one point. I was a noob at one point. A cold one was a noob at one point. Whoops was never a noob, but like most people were noobs. But look at me with my kitted fang and my infernal cape standing next to this man here with his fire cape and non kitted fang. You can just tell. You can tell who plays the game too much and needs to get laid more often. And it's this guy! Bada bing, bada boom. Bang. Bang. That is a huge upgrade. This is a colossal upgrade. 10,000, 2,500. All right, we should be Gucci Mane. Scoochie. Okay, so I've settled for an invo list that I think should be pretty cozy. I do not want to put on hardcore run because I only have like 45K in my bank. And if I die, I can't get my stuff back. And that would be too bad. So softcore run is on. Walk for it is on. Need some help. The first one is on. Walk the path is on. No other path invos. Deadly prayers on a diet. Dehydration. Lively larva blowing mud. Everything else is the same. Wait, what? Oh my god, dude. What are these boulders? What is happening, man? It's my first TOA back. Make it fucking easy for me. I gotta run all the way, then all the way back in two fucking boulders. Suck my dick, bro. What am I seeing, man? No, I don't have a pickaxe! Oh no, I forgot to put my dragon pickaxe in here. Oh no! Oh man, this is just going from bad to worse. If you were curious about where all my HP went, don't be. 338. I was doing like five and a half to six minute Kefries before and I just did it in 338. That's why the Void Waker is so good because we got to spec the Major and two hit the Major, which is crazy. And then I can do so much sniping on the other things. I forgot my pickaxe again. What am I doing, bro? 
I was so pissed after I died in the last one. I literally just went right back in. I didn't even consider that I needed to get my dragon pickaxe. I'm a moron, dude. Okay, I know I said I was going to skull skip, but I just wanted to get the kill because this I've really struggled to even get one raid going here. So I believe that is a deathless 405. So we're kind of back. I really struggled, as you can tell by my inventory. I have one dose of sand few left. Okay, we're getting back into it. The muscle memory was starting to come back. It was just a little slow going at first. You know, we're going right back to the nakedness. It's 8.8%, so I imagine skull skipping would have to get me about 10% if I didn't die. Here we go, come on, be purple. Be purple for the first one, that'd be amazing. It's white. Anything good? No, that is particularly bad. I'm putting the pickaxe in the storage, but this is a notable achievement, I feel. All right, where is my light bearer? I've done this whole raid with no ring on? Oh my God, what was that, man? Oh, I've just failed the raid right at the end. Oh, I'm so pissed, dude. What am I doing, man? It's white. Anything cool? The pet, perhaps? Cash rune? We like cash runes. Soul runes. 33.49. That was lightning quick, man. That was a really good raid. That was more along the lines of what I was expecting these were going to be like. It's a white light. But that was a good raid. I'm, I'm very satisfied with that. Yeah, that felt cozy. I'm getting more comfortable. Nice. That's a good drop. And he's, now he's hitting me for nothing but fucking maxes, dude. Oh, nine, 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 ten, eight. Fuck my fucking dick, bro. We got it done. I was a little uncomfortable first rowing there for a little while. It's been a while since I've won rowed. We got it done. Eight percent. We died. Uh, let's go. Purple. Ah, the fourth raid back. We get a purple. Where are we going? Come on, baby, come on. Let's get my friend here to hang out. Give me something good. Give me something good. I got my friend here to observe. Some money, give me some money. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. It's a ward. It's a little bit of money. We'll take it. Better than nothing. I can't get my thing out. Ah, why, why do I have so many smelling salts? Why, why is he always hitting me for 20 through my prayer 18 fucking 21 suck my dick man he's level fucking one i'm gonna have to go back to fucking red xing this dude he's so fucking annoying to fight 16 fuck you there we go not the cleanest end but that was a pretty good raid 8.94 percent we skull skipped everything so we're a little less than one in 10 i guess got it done pretty quick not the cleanest warden in the world but an improvement from yesterday it's a new day this is the first of the day i'm pretty satisfied with uh the improvement that we've had from yesterday so we'll take it you know whatever they can't all be purple so no ah uh, no i'm dead Whew. that was pretty bad that final enraged phase was pretty bad but we got another deathless that's back to back deathless are we rewarded for our skill? We are not, but that's okay because we just got one like two raids ago. Anything good from the white chest? A pet, perhaps? Cash runes? Blood runes? Nah, man. No fucking way do I take that much damage, dude! 21, 21, 15 double baboons! I got no blood theories! He's level one! Like, do me a favor, bro! What am I seeing? One death. Shitty death to Baba. Undeserved in my books absolute rng fest but we got the raid done 158 we've done eight since we've come back we've gotten one purple and we remain on eight purple on one purple not eight purple i'd like eight purple anything cool yo that's a lot of magic seeds double magic seed roll 500k we take that and a good amount of death runes that was about as close as they come holy cow oh my god i threw so hard on the very end of that Everything I did was a throw job. And we did not get a purple. Dragon medium element, no way. Sir, you guys saw that, right? Where he just walked underneath me while I was already on that square. He just said, hey, fuck you, man. And all that you stand for and everything that you've ever loved in your entire life. You guys saw that. I know you did. I'm a moron, man. That was really terrible performance there at the end. Yo.
yo, that was some of the finest footwork known to man. That was immaculate. Immaculate. They have the immaculate reception. That was the immaculate footwork. It does not get better than that. That was a clinic, ladies and gentlemen. What you have just seen was footwork in old school RuneScape taken to the absolute extreme. Oh my god. Gosh, what a performance, what a show, what a good show, good show. Like this is not country music, man. Jimmy Buffett is not country. If I say give me Jimmy Buffett radio, they should not give me a couple Jimmy Buffett songs and a bunch of country songs. I will die on this hill. I'm pretty sure I just skipped a phase. On a 400, we just skipped a phase. We must have been zooming 225. <laughs> oh my God, we smoked him, bro. <laughs> we cleaned his clock, dude. Holy cow. What are we saying? Like if I say Jimmy Buffett radio, give me fucking Jimmy Buffett. Give me five o'clock somewhere. Give me brown eyed girl. And that one kid rock song, Summer of 69. Wait, is that Brian Adams? What's a kid rock song? And, and Summer of 69. Give me them both if they're not the same song. Yo, this is toxic as fuck, man. Stop. What were those boulders, bro? That was like the most toxic thing ever. While I'm listening to Buffett? Oh, no way. I fucking hate this boss, man. See, the one boss that actually takes fucking skill in the raid, I'm good at. The one that is just a fucking RNG fest where you get hit for fucking 24 17 the boss just stops walking halfway through the room and pulls you off your fucking thing it's the one that kills me I and mean, we died to fucking baba because baba's the worst boss in the game and we got a white whatever i don't care i got 12 snapdragon seed oh my god what did i just do what have i just done <laughs> no death nine percent nine point one two percent chance and it's purple. The second purple, we've done 11 kills. We've gotten two purple chests. Let's go, man, let's go. Let me get my buddy out here. We're gonna call Jerry in. Come on, Jerry, come hang out with us. Get us something good, Jerry. I think last time we had the green one, so this time we got the red, Jerry. Something cool, come on, a Missouri piece, a fang, something good. A fang, we'll take it. We will take a Osmumpton's Fang that is 30 million GP that we will stick right in our bank. And that gives us a lot of breathing room with supplies. Oh, we might be able to buy an upgrade. How much are tacits? 19 mil. So do we buy a BGS or do we buy tacits? I'm gonna do a think job. I'm gonna go sell this. I'm gonna go to the pool. I'm gonna lay out. I'm gonna do a think job. All right, didn't really expect that to happen. 30 million, 200,000 GP, insta sold. We'll take it. 29 mil to the bank. The bank is now worth 2.11 billion GP over 2.1 bill. We're rolling in the dough, baby. We are on the way up. Let's go. Alrighty, the decision has been made. I have purchased myself a pair of Bandosian Tacits. I'm hoping that the extra defense helps me out a little bit at Bob, but that's kind of my thinking here. Nice. Two in a row. Deathless, that was the first one with the Bandosian Tacits. Can we go back to back? I've never had back to back purples, so that would be pretty cool. We cannot this time. That's okay. We'll save it for later. We're saving ourselves for the band back to backs because we are a good little Christian boy. That's cap. Wow, double cactus spine drops can suck my balls. But it doesn't matter. That's three in a row without dying. They have not been the cleanest Warden P4s, which I'm usually pretty good at, so that gives me confidence. It's what? Three in a row deathless, though, is 57K. 57k from a 405 tombs of a masket get some help man holy sh dude that was like the slowest raid ever ever i didn't die but i failed the time because obscenely slow 828 warden was actually kind of quick but look at some of these times man First of all, I was sitting and texting. But a 359 Zabak, I've done that in under three. 351 Baba, I've done that in under three. 530 Aka, I've done that in under four and a half. 436 Capri, I've done that in like 330. Every single one, an extra minute. Plus, I'm sitting here texting in the middle of rooms. Like, come on, man. Give me good RNG on the ones where I, I be distracted. This game is terrible. What the f***? That's it. This is my official declaration that I am only red Xing this boss from now on. It is a waste of my fucking time to deal with the absolute ignorant 
fucking bullshit that this boss puts forth into the fucking game. So I will no longer be doing it the correct way. I will only be doing it the way that is not supposed to be done, the way that breaks the integrity of the game. And I will be doing it proudly because that boss is a fucking joke. Thank you for coming to my TED talk there. We died to Baba again because it's the worst boss in the raid, but that's okay. We got a raid done 165 for the white chest. Put my shoes on. Pet. Wow. That's, that's a good chest. Easy game. I mean, we died to the monkey room. The pre-monkey room, not Baba, the room before it. We ran X Baba this time because I said I was going to and I did, but then I died to the room before it. I did like four in a row and then I've died in the last two. It's another white light, that's fine. We've done 16, we've got 34 to go. We should be expecting some more purples. That is pretty okay. Oh my God, all we got to kill. Would have been the first deathless of the day, but alas, we threw right at the very end. No purple, unsurprisingly, wouldn't be deserved to be fair. I wouldn't deserve purple. Deathless to start the day. Come on, baby, what's it go up to when I walk through? 9% on the dot, one in 10 but it's one in zero. Wait, can't be one in zero. That's not how math works. Rain our seats though, that's pretty good. What? Why can't, oh my God, I'm gonna die. Bruh. My inventory's too full? What the fuck is this? How do I find a different way to die to the goddamn fucking monkey room every single fucking time? I hate this. Room. My inventory is too full to equip my blowpipe. Suck my fucking dick. How have I done that? No, I double clicked my prayer. <sighs> Very clean. 169. 19 raids completed. That was deathless. One in 11 for a purple. And it is purple, ladies and gentlemen. It's purple. Hooey. All right, let's go. We're gonna get the blue guy out this time because the one thing we want is a magical weapon. So we're getting the mage thrall. The mage Jerry is here to hang out with us. No, 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 you stay here, sir. Give me the staff or a Missouri top. Give me anything. Oh my fucking God. Oh my God, we got it too. We can shadow. Get the fuck out of here. Get out of here, man. 1.2 billion GP, the Tumic and shadow. Oh my God. Oh my God, I don't even know what to say. I did not, oh my God, dude. Oh my God, you gotta be kidding me. You have got to be kidding me, bro. Tumic and Shadow, are you serious right now? I'm gonna use my own, the one that I pulled. That's mine now. That's my Tumic and Shadow now. I pulled it. I got that bad boy. Oh, holy shit. Oh my God, I'm mind blown. I don't even know what to say. I don't know what to do. I'm, I, I feel like an idiot. I've lost like any composure. All my composure's out the window. My head is gone. I, I my head is gone. I'm in the clouds. We pulled a Tumikin Shadow for 1.272 billion GP. We started the series with nothing but a Tumikin Shadow in our bank. We now have two of them. The total bank value is now worth 3.37 billion GP, bro. Oh my God, you've got to be kidding me. 2.1 bill, and now it is 3.37 bill. Oh my God, I don't even know what to say. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. I'm, I'm gonna go sell it. I have to go sell it. I'm gonna go sell it and buy a Twisted Bow. I, I like, I don't even really know what to say right now, man. <laughs> I, I am literally, I've gone stupid. Like no words are coming to mind. Nothing intelligent is coming to my brain that I should say. So I'm just gonna get this bad boy listed. One, two, eight, zero. One, two, three, one, two, three. 1.280 billion GP. We're gonna get taxed five mil on it, but get this bad boy out here. We're gonna wait for that to sell, and then we're gonna be like a triple, a, a, a three billionaire, three billion GP air. Bang! Bang! It's gone, ladies and gentlemen. One billion two hundred and seventy-five million GP. A very humble 3.39 billion GP is what the bank value is worth. Now, what do you do? What do you do when you have 1.2 billion GP? You sell about 200, billion, 200 million GP worth of items so that you can buy a Twisted Bow. I'm gonna figure out how to revert these and then we're gonna sell my crystal stuff and we'll be just, we'll be in the ballpark for a Twisted Bow. Boom, 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 boom. Bow of Ferdinandum sold. 1.421 billion GP. All right, it's been like six hours. I've increased the price twice. 
I'm sick of this not buying, so I'm throwing every single cent I have at it. One four four nine one three eight one two three. And now we wait. What is happening in the chat? No, 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 no. Who are these people? What's happening? We can't be having this. We cannot be had. Not, not, n not at the Grand Exchange. Not at the GE. Take it, take it somewhere else. Not at the GE. Oh my God! It bought. Ladies and gentlemen, I am the proud owner of a Twisty Bisty. The singular best item in old school RuneScape is now mine. We are now the rightful owners of the best range weapon in the game, the Twisted Bow. And you may be wondering what we're going to do with it. We're going to sell these things for the time being. We can buy them back if we need them. We're going to do a more consistent money maker with our maximum mage gear and our maximum, well, as close to max range gear as, you can, as we can uh, afford. So let's get geared up and then let's go get prepared to visit the Grumbler. All right, there we have it. Some money obtained. Basilisk Jaw, 18 million. Void Waker, 137 million. Bandos Tacits, 20 million. Osmumpton's Fang, 30 million. Putting us at a nice cozy cash stack, 206 million GP. We can't forget the 696 GP that we had in the bank. I don't know what range gear to buy. What's good range gear? I've been so focused on the shadow, I forget what range gear is. Okay, so full Missouri. We can't afford, afford full Missouri. If my brain is working well here, I'm going to buy an Armadil crossbow. Holy shit, that's expensive. Uh, we're going to buy an Anguish because Anguish good. Missouri body. All right, as usual when I'm bossing, no real thoughts in my head. Just kind of vibes. First use with the twisted bow. Oh my gosh, 72. Oh my god. <laughs> what a weapon this is. The twisted bow. Who would have thunk? Very good weapon. I had no idea. Okay, a little bit of muscle memory we're going to have to get back, but wow. That was pretty good. New PB immediately. New PB. Easy game, bro. The Twisted Bow is a good weapon. I had no idea. That thing fucking smacks, man. Bang. That was fast. Is that a new PB? 206 for the Dragon Bolts. Yo, what a drop. This is a good ball. <laughs> it's only funny that I say that because, like, if you go back to me doing this for the first time when it had just come out, every clip is me going, this boss fucking sucks. <laughs> I'm a dumbass. Oh my god, bro. That was rapid. 150. What was that? What? What? Master combat. Okay, so I think the Grandmaster is like obscenely fast. But that was fucking zooming, bro. All right, while we're here, I figure we'll do some uh, combat achievements. So I'm going to try to do this one without running, and this one where I drain it with three sources in this one kill. Is that both of them? Yes, can't escape and, can't escape and versatile drainer, bro. We are gaming. I will not accept that this is not surrounded. This must be the combat achievement. Yes. <laughs> I was going to say, he's, he's in there, man. He, he's pretty tight. A frozen cash. Let's go. Gimme, gimme, gimme. Bang! Dragon plate skirt. That one I know wasn't perfect. That was fucking speedy though. 135. Oh my god, we almost got the Grandmaster time. I don't know about that one. He hit me with a melee right toward the end. Oh, there it is. Walk straight, pray true. Okay, I didn't really think I I had I got it on that one, but I did. He hit me with a melee at the end for sure. So I don't know what the fuck. I don't know how this works. Oh, Venator Shard. Let's go. Okay, 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 okay. I believe that's 10 kills. Yes, there we go. The Essence Farmer. That must be it. Yes! <laughs> Moosepa Manipulator. Holy crap, dude. Finally! Oh my god, that took ages. I should have had it so long ago, and I kept throwing, and then the range thing was funky, and I... Whatever, it doesn't matter. I finally got it. I'm so freaking happy, man. Yes, we did it. That was a pain in the dick. Oh, we got it for seven minutes and 50 seconds. We got a frozen cash for it. Anything good? Wow, eight radar seeds. So we've completed all but the Grandmaster speed run. All right, uh, I'm buying a Twisted Buckler because the Armadale is bad, man. Gimme, gimme, gimme. Nice. Okay, that is an improvement to the setup. A hard clue scroll. We're not going to do that. Who the hell do they think we are? Some kind of collection logger or something? Not I. Not me, sir. Not today. Three hondo, ladies and germs. We did it. Yeah. Yeah, that's deserved. I tried to be cheeky. I tried to get an extra smite off because both of my specs missed. 
Shouldn't have done that. Fair enough. Fair enough. Fair enough. Fair enough. Deserve. Well deserved. Dragon plate legs. Let's go. The best drop in the game from the boss. Double dragon plate legs. 321k. I mean, I guess the best drop is actually the Venator shard. Venator? The dildo. The dildo. But the dragon plate legs we take. God damn it. Now I've said dildo in the clip. Whatever. Why did I just do that? I knew that that could kill me. That's it. That has to be it. That was so fast. Bang! 129 by a second. Let's go, man. <laughs> Let's go. We got the screw the Grandmaster speed. And that was zooming, bro. 129. Let's go! And we only had one spec with the ACB. And it took like three or four hits. That could have been like a 120, man. That was that was zooming, bro. So let's just take a quick peeksy here at the bosses in the combat achievements because I believe the Phantom Muspa, the Grumbler, is green. We've got all of the Grumbler, Grumbler combat achievements done. 400 kill count. Why the f*** did I just die? What happened? It's my first day back in like eight days, four days. So I felt a little wonky, but I, what did I do? I have to go rewatch that. I have no idea how, did I just run across the spike? No, <laughs> oh my God, bro. That was so bad. I was taking so much damage. <laughs> <laughs> I think I got hit by like four or five spikes. <laughs> oh, double dragon plate legs. Let's freaking go. Oh, frozen cachet. Bang. 565 essence in the frozen cachet. Oh, a frozen cachet. Oh, my lord. Another frozen cachet. Back to back cachets. Say it ain't so. Bang. Son of a bitch, why are those things still fucking chasing me, man? What am I supposed to do? What am I supposed to do? I get chased to the other side of the fucking room by fucking spikes. I gotta run all the way around them. I miss the fucking thing by one game tick. Ugh. Oh, a cachet. If you hate that I say cachet, comment and tell me how to pronounce cachet for the algorithm. Be a cool guy. 500 kill count. We've got all sorts of shit on the ground. I'm a little overwhelmed by how much there is. That was 600 kill count. 600 case. All right, hello there, ladies and gentlemen. Um, this is going to serve as a quick state of the union. I know that probably seems weird because it's been like one second for you, but for me, it's been like eight or nine days. At la when last we spoke, I was killing the Phantom Muspa to make some money. And then uh, I went and got laid up on a beach somewhere drinking a cold uh, water with a nice, pretty water bot laid up next to me. So had a good time, um, but now I'm back and I'm ready to game. So current state of the union, it is currently out. Sorry, excuse me. <laughs> it is currently July 25th, Tuesday, July 25th, which means it is one day pre the release of Desert Treasure 2. Currently, where we sit, I have nearly full max range, and I do have max mage apart from the eternal boots, which are dog shit. So we've got like 15, 15 ish million GP that we could liquidate pretty quickly. Now, with the upcoming release of Desert Treasure 2, I feel like I want a little bit of everything. So the main thing that I want to work toward, since I have good range gear with the twisted belt, <laughs> and I have good mage gear with the Tumican Shadow. Uh, the main thing I want to work for is at least like a viable melee setup. So it's not going to be anything fancy because I only have 20 million GP to work with. But I have the Vernick, I got Blood Fury, I got my Infernal Cape, I got Fighter Torso. All good things. I got Barrow's Gloves. I need to get money for a Fang. I need to make like 10 million GP. So uh, in the next like 20 hours, I'm going to camp the shit out of Moosebuck. Hopefully I get Venador Shard Drop because that would be huge. Let's, uh, let's go do some Moosba and let's see if we can make some money before the release of Desert Treasure 2. How does that sound? I forgot about these spikes. Oh, did you see that? I fucking juked the shit out of them. I did that on purpose, trust me. That, that was a professional gamer moment. Who's that kill, dude? Frozen cachet? Five Snapdragon seeds, yo. We take that. Alrighty, I'm done with the moose buff for the day. So let's sell what we don't need. Uh, let's sell the loot tab and we'll see if we have enough for a fang. I haven't even begun to think about if I will have enough. I hopefully do. If not, whatever. We go in without a real melee weapon tomorrow. Uh, we'll buy a whip or something and that'll do. All right, we're going to sell off the Ancient Essence. We are going to fall short. See, any Venator Shard in like the last 300 KC, we would have easily had enough for a fang. 
But alas, it is what it is. So instead of buying a Fang, I think, do I have a tentacle whip? I do have a tentacle whip. Oh, pretty well stocked up on things and stuff. Alrighty, so I've done a little bit of research on things that I feel like could be required for the quest. And by done research, I mean, I pretty much copied exactly what Foe is doing because if there is one thing I'm good at, ow. It's identifying when I am not well enough equipped to figure something out and letting other people do it for me. So this is basically Foe's loadout. I have copied it to a T. I have found myself at this mysterious pyramid that I've never seen before in the game. And it is currently 1026 PM Eastern Standard Time, thing, which means that in seven hours and 34 minutes or something, my math has been messed up by Mr. Colors for you. Uh, the quest will be out and I will be standing here, which seems like the right place to be. So until then, I bid you all a Vita Zen. Thank you all so much for tuning into the video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please feel free to drop a like and a subscription. In the next one, we conquer Desert Treasure 2. So make sure to come back for that.